Hey guys, Tony here for Tony Tech Bytes, and this is the Pixel 4 that Google sent over to me, and uh, I'm gonna unbox it in this video. But after unboxing this, I'm gonna surprise my dad with it, and I've probably already filmed it. So I'm gonna unbox it first in this video, and then I'm gonna surprise my dad with a new phone because he's currently using a Pixel 2, and before that, he was using the original Pixel, so I feel like he's really gonna enjoy this 4A. So chronologically speaking, I'm gonna unbox this first, then I'm gonna surprise him, and then I'm probably gonna post this unboxing after that video is already up. In case you're probably wondering how uh, I filmed an unboxing after I already surprised him, this is how. So let's just get straight into the unboxing of this Pixel 4a. And also, if you wanna check it out, I'll link it in the description down below for your convenience. And if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe because it supports my content. All right, we are overhead. Let's unbox the Pixel 4a. So uh, all I have is this box here. They didn't send me anything else, uh, so. Actually, I believe we can just peel these off. Yes, this is pretty satisfying. More satisfying than actually using a sharp object. So we just peel this off and come on. Oh, there we have it. Feels pretty smooth. Uh, well, sort of smooth. So let's take this out. Here's the Pixel 4a. I haven't done much research on this phone yet. Uh, we pretty much just announced like yesterday, I think. So here's the box. Let's take a look at the manuals. I'm gonna ruin this. Just open it up. So we have set up your new Pixel, meet your new Pixel. Safety, warranty information, and the SIM ejection tool. A USB-C power adapter, really nice to see. Uh, Apple, supposedly they might not include one. USB-C cable, this looks pretty short though. Uh, I'm not sure if this is like a traditional three meter one. And we got a USB-C to USB type A dongle uh, to transfer over data uh, from your previous phone, I believe. So yeah, we can just put this to the side, check out the new phone. So here we have it, the Pixel 4a. So let's uh, peel it. Peel it. So that was pretty satisfying. Uh, there's no plastic on the back, it's just in the front, and that is uh, pretty much it. It's really lightweight, it's actually surprisingly really small. Let me go grab my OnePlus 8 and compare it. All right, so the OnePlus 8, this is significantly larger than the Pixel 4a. Uh, it's obviously not even a comparison here. OnePlus 8 is significantly larger. I'm not gonna go over specs or uh, any comparison or setting up the phone in this video because I just want to unbox it, take it out of the box and show you all what it looks like. So we got the power button, volume rocker, USB-C port at the bottom as well as uh, your speakers. Headphone jack at the top, surprising to see in a smartphone in 2020. And you also got, I believe, a fingerprint sensor. And I really like how this feels in the hand. Surprisingly, really nice feel and uh, fits my hands. I have pretty small hands, so definitely feels pretty good. I guess if I'm gaming, it's not that bad at all. Let me go take out my iPhone 10s and let's compare it in size. It might look a little bit dirty, it's been in a case and stuff. iPhone 10s, iPhone 10 size, it's pretty much the same size actually. Like, it's almost identical, kind of crazy. Uh, yeah, it's pretty much almost identical as an iPhone or like an iPhone 10, iPhone 10s. So yeah, uh, I'm not gonna turn it on and set it up in this video because I'm saving it for a little bit later. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe. Yet again, this was sent by Google, uh, but I'm not sponsored to make this video, and I might make a review, camera comparison, all that stuff in the future. I'm gonna put this back in the box and save it for a surprise video. Thank you all so much for watching.